You should see my room. Oh, you filming? Hi! No, <laughs> no I'm not filming. Oh. So, hello viewers of Sounding Board. Today we're going to look at some Amazon <laughs> stuff Katie bought from it's overseas. It's not from Amazon. It's in the Amazon box. Yes, because I put it in here. This is actually the box that I um, held your books. I got cheated out of that box? <laughs> yeah, this is the box. So that means I should have got two of these books right here. Uh, not one. Maybe. but um, So these are actually overseas items. Okay. However, I didn't order from overseas. Really? No. Why not? I ordered from someone from New York, I believe, if I remember correctly. Uh huh. It's been a few weeks since I, um, you know. You got I, them? Yeah. And I want to show them off because I thought they were so cool, so unique. I mean, I've seen some in the um, Joelopolis, which is like a Sega theme park. What's Joelopolis? It's in Tokyo. It's actually a um, place where you can go ride um, some road coasters. So it's like one little big, huge road coaster. Is it inside. Sega Land, basically? It's very much like Sega Land because every item in there is Sega related. Wow, I should go out there. To and you also get a chance to meet Sonic the Hedgehog as a mascot. Shake his hand, take photo ups. I should go out there and just to make you jealous. Oh, uh, it would make me jealous. I have like a... Um, and then send you a postcard that says, wish you were here. They probably do sell it, but they sell also Sonic merch there. Like, um, the Korean one's his favorite one everyone would like to go there for. But, um, I have a, um, pretty much a basic map of Joyopolis because someone was nice enough to send it to me. And, um, that's right now in my room. I haven't brought it out yet. That might be a good item to bring out to That might off. be a good item to frame on the wall. Oh, it would, but I would like to have two of them because um, certain things are, like, in certain places. It's pretty much just a map of what's in there, what to call, all that. It's pretty much just a flyer you get at Disneyland. But, but not as woke. But some of these items are actually from Joyopolis. Uh, uh, they're not from the movie? They are from the movie. They're actually based off of the Sonic the Hedgehog movie that came out at, um, in 2020. Back when COVID and lockdown happened, it was all Sonic's fault. <laughs> no, I think it's a curse of why Sonic fans asked for it and then we Sonic. Gave it. No, we had to pay gave for us COVID. penance. We had to pay for the penance for the fact is we asked for a good redesign. No, Sonic, Sonic gave everyone COVID. No. And that's your one best movie of the year. But we're getting a sequel, which is coming out next year. Woo! And right now, I believe they're in Hawaii. Whoa, Working. Hawaii. Yeah, they're almost done, I think. I, I haven't been staying up to the news right there. So let's see what's in the box. So, do you want to see what's in the box? Uh, yes. So, let's see. What first item should I take out? I might as well get this started. So, first item I'm going to show off is a Sonic keychain. I like how they added the gold ring right here as a loop to, you know. So it's thematic. Yeah. And this is actually 3D. You can actually touch it and feel it. Oh, I can feel his balls. No. All That's why it's called Japanese. Joyopolis. You can see who pretty much um, bought it and everything else right here. But, like you were saying, that's why it's called Joyopolis. No. What, I can't corrupt your Sonic? No, but we got another Sonic keychain item. So... Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is a sticker that goes on your phone or something. Maybe. Well, it looks like it's attached to the keychain. Yeah, but the keychain's not attachable right here. It's like it's only um, stay put. Huh. And this part you can actually just remove. Oh, wow. But it looks like one of those phone things you can have. Could so, be. Um, I think it is. I think this is supposed to be for your phone, and this is just a dangling thing you can have on the side. You know what I've seen a lot of phones carry these. You know it would be awesome? If Mario was at the end of the keychain. What? What's wrong with Mario? No. Some Japanese words on the back. Pretty cool. Mario has a few Japanese words for you because you threw him. Isn't that right, Mario? Now I'm going to show something I liked. Mario? A Sonic standy. You're going to open it? Yeah. 
You gonna depreciate it? Uh, not as much as it's already worth too much. To be honest, they already had a hole in it. Oh. And this is actually the one item I would, you know. Display? Yeah. It's kind of hard not to want to display it because it looks so awesome. Did you already put it together before? Yes. I know, I'm bad, aren't I? You depreciated it. So you say. Oh, I say, I say. I know But it's kind of hard items. not to when you, when something this cool looks awesome. So pretty much like that. And then you get the cool Sonic right here. What do you think? Yeah. And then we can have Stan Lee stand next to it. Because he likes being in cameos. He doesn't care <laughs> whose movie it is. Getting him? Yes. Um. His shirt's so thick. He has two shirts. Let's see. Now he's giving the devil sign. Not first time. <laughs> there you go. So now we... I think this was worth the buy, to be honest. Who, Stanley? No, the Sonic thing. Now put Stanley over here. I mean, what do you think? Yeah. I'm pretty much um, putting it back where it was. So you don't scratch it? Yeah. Because this will be on display in my um, Sonic room. Your Sonic Museum room? So everyone says... But it's just a sonic room for me. That's really too hard to clean. That doesn't have no sonic t-shirts in it. Yeah, sonic t-shirts. The floor doesn't count. <laughs> Not on the floor. It's actually in my closet. On the floor. In the closet. On the floor. So what you're saying is sonic comes out of the closet? No. It makes a lot of people happy. It'll make you happy. And one other person I can think of that won't sign on for um, Sonic Adventure 2 Hell. You mean Shadow? No. But that's pretty much it. What do you think? There's nothing else? No, there's more. Now, this item I don't quite know much of. But I thought it was pretty cool when looking at it. It's a baby tumbler Brandon can't spill. Yes. Pretty much has all this. I think it's an ice cream cup. Maybe. It also has like a little hole right yeah. here, and a bigger one right here. Oh, it's a baby cup. It is a sippy cup. And you have Sonic right here, running. And then on the other side is the Sonic the Hedgehog the movie. Now, I don't know where this item is from, but I thought it was pretty cool and I just couldn't pass it. Now I, the last... I can pass it if you want, like a football. Now the last item. Now this item I thought was a poster. I was ordering. I'm You're excited gonna... to get a Sonic poster. Well, I wasn't going to order on the Sega shop because this is what I thought was a poster. It is a poster. It's not. So it is. It's a folder. Really? Let's see. The folder, don't you see the edges right here? No. Because you're blind. Yeah. But the cool part is you can open it up. So it's two posters. It's, it's a folder. It's... Look, it even has a, like a little crease right there. It's two posters. It's a p it's a folder, even on the other side. It's wrapping paper on the inside. Oh it's even plastic. To protect your posters. It's not a poster. <laughs> You're so, me. any last words about your poster and the rest of the items here? It's not a poster. It's a poster. But I like my items. I'm glad I ordered them. And um, it's worth it if you can get something that's from overseas. Yeah. So, thank you for watching. And please subscribe to us.